All right, so in this uh, video, we're going to go ahead and go over uh, a few things on how to, well, the beginnings of uh, Medieval Templar Knight. Um, so go ahead and set up your file. Um, I'll go ahead and do that. All right, nice. so setting up your files, make sure you go to a project window, um, select new, uh, and select new. Uh, make sure you um, put it in the right folder, hit accept. And then go back to file, set project, make sure you select folder, hit set. Um, I already did that, so I'm just going to cancel that. And then um, then we'll get started. All right, uh, so first thing you have to do is download that uh file the gladiator file um and once you download it uh, make sure it's in where your project is and just drag and drop hit continue and there you are there is your model and we will go over um, how to um, use quadro and we're going to use quadro to draw shirts shirt and a pair of pants this guy um, could use some of that and so first thing we have to do is uh, make sure we're in object mode select the object and then right here we need to turn on um, live surface and now when the surface is live if you hit shift uh, and right click go down to quadraw tool and now you can start drawing. Um, I really like to get started with the collar. Um, oh, I uh, also want to go over here and make sure that it's not off, but on object X, this is um, a symmetrical way of drawing. And since we're basically doing the same thing, um, I just draw four, uh, hence the name Quadraw, uh, four dots, and then I hold shift and I make these uh, planes. And I'm just going to go around and continue to make these planes. To make a collar. And I don't like, well, yeah, I can take these and move this. And there we have a collar. I'm just going to relax these, hold shift, and use it, use it like a paintbrush tool. Just kind of relax the geometry and um, really straighten things out. There we go. Watch the way that looks. Uh, and then just continue to quadro. And so from here, I'll uh, probably do something like this. Hold shift. And some of you might, I didn't really explain this well. I grabbed the script and I just attached these together. And I'm basing my decisions off of how far I probably should go down and this continuation of this quad um, polygon. You don't want, uh, when you're doing quad draws, you don't want um, triangles. And so here, just left click, hold, drag, and they come together. And that is Quadra. Now, when we get to see how it kind of messes up in certain areas, so I'll just add one of these. Let's see. 
kind of force the software to do what it is you need it to do. There we go. And now I could do this. That is, there we go. All right, so you also, much like the caller, you want to. Um, I don't like what is going on here. So I think I'm going to delete that. So if you're going to delete, uh, use the select tool, delete, and get back into quad draw. you're in object mode and then select quadra if you can't find it right away. Oops. All right. So I just back it up. There we go. Let's take this and then we can uh, do the sleeve uh, and then connect it into this collar. Um, we're going to just start. And I'm kind of imagining a sleeve and the location of the sleeve. Probably should have went a little lower. That's all good. Now, and bring this down, and I can just hold shift and relax the uh, topology. 
and just continue to go around and do the same. So basically just do your best to um, cover and then go from there. Uh, I know I'm going relatively fast, so um, I'm just left clicking to provide the dots. Then holding shift to create the quad. Let's go back over here. There we go. There we go. And I can just use multiple dots just to make it quick. If I hold shift, I can relax the uh, topology, straighten it out. Really get nice topology going. This I'm not a fan of, so let's change that. Change that. There we go. And then we just kind of start connecting things. There we go. So this, I might have to chop up. There we go. So to chop up, I just have hold control. And this provides an edge loop. So uh, I'm just going to relax the typology over here. And you might be thinking this is a triangle, but this is actually four. So that is a quad. There we go. There we go. Relax this typology. Okay. 
great. And just keep going all the way down. I'm going to go ahead and pause the video and uh, just continue to go um, down to his waist. Okay, so I'm pretty much done with the shirt. I'm just going to relax. Everything's going to hold shift, left click and drag. And just to make sure all the topology looks great. Not liking this, let's move that. That's kind of twisted. Okay. All the topology looks great. All right, and then now, um, right click, go to face. Uh, just poly surface. Oops. Let's go to object mode. Face, uh, and then select all that. And now we can get a shirt, just pull it out a little bit. There you go. Now we have a shirt. I'm going to change the name of that to shirt, and that becomes an object. Uh, you'll do the pants the same way. Um, obviously, you're going to go through each leg. Um, I would start with the uh, waist and then work my way. And I, I would use this part of the leg kind of like a sleeve. Um, same down here, probably right here as well, because you have the distinct spot you got to get to, and you know. Um, so give it a shot. Uh, again, relax your topology, and you should be good to go. Um, 